The Rupununi is a special place because of its natural beauty. It has dry woodland landscapes, rainforests, anti savannas, wetlands. I love it. All right, so that one over there, that bird over there, that's the male. The 2024 Whitley Award winner Leroy Ignacio works in the Rupununi region of Guyana, a vast area with a unique combination of habitats that make it extremely diverse. But like much of the region, it's faced the increased threats of modernization, climate change, and habitat loss. Habitat destruction mainly occurs through uncontrolled fires. But just over two decades ago, a charismatic species was recorded for the first time and helped change all that. So when discovery happened, this was like great news, great news for the world, great news for us. Known to the local communities, but previously unknown to science in Guyana, the endangered red siskin, a songbird known for its beauty, which makes it highly sought after in the illegal caged bird trade. When I hear this bird, it just hits my heart. Leroy could see that by protecting the red siskin, he also had an opportunity to help preserve the Rupununi. Pinus cuculata. Working with local communities, Leroy and others formed the South Rupununi Conservation Society. They've created a community-managed conservation zone, educated local people, and trained rangers to monitor and manage the red siskins. 99. Community-led approach, community-led activities, community decision made on what they want. People were proud of what they're doing. It really made them feel that they're doing something for the world from their small backyards. This grassroots approach has been extremely effective. Because of the team's work, incidents of illegal trapping have been almost completely eliminated in Guyana. The Siskin population has now stabilized, giving hope for the survival of the species. The support for red Siskin conservation work has to continue every year. It cannot stop. With the Whitley Award, Leroy now wants to increase the size of the conservation zone to 150,000 hectares. He will train more local people as rangers and promote traditional burning practices that won't ravage the Siskin's habitat. This is the bird that has created all of this movement and conservation in the Rupununi. By protecting one tiny bird, the community is helping to safeguard this precious ecosystem.